A little bit of cinnamon in this one. That is it. It's really love doing Banana Island even for just a short time. Mmm. Wow. Better than I remember. So good. Hey you guys, it's me. I just wanted to show you, I don't think I ever showed you my ab roller. I don't even know what brand this is. It may just be called ab roller. Oh, it's a gold gym one, I guess. I think it was like the cheapest one that they had. It's pretty basic in function. In fact, it didn't even fit right. It's supposed to stay flush against there and it doesn't, but actually I think it adds for a little bit of instability, which probably uh, helps core strength a little bit. I'm feeling pretty good, feeling really slim. I'm noticing, I'm not gonna show you guys yet. I'm gonna hold off for a few uh, more days or so till I film a video for my 15 months. I always forget what it is, 14 or 15. 15 months uh, is coming up here at the end of the month. So I'm really excited about that and I'll get you guys out some uh, comparison shots because I'm definitely noticing it's like ever so slowly. Like last week I just I'll notice, you know, touching my own hip. It's like, oh, okay. I like how that feels. And you know, today I just noticed there's there's a little more of a line here. Getting I think this ab roller is definitely helping me to develop some ab strength. I have some ab strength, but I'm definitely uh, in need of some more. <laughs> So I guess I'm kind of focusing on abs right now because I feel like that's my uh, trouble spot. I do have stretch marks and um, I'm just such like a bikini person. I want to be able to run around in a bikini and the reason is not, it's not because I want to show off or anything. It's because I honestly like, I feel too hot if I go outside in a one piece. It's just... Honestly, like when I like to go outside in a bathing suit, I like it to be really hot. And um, so I'm just, I'm warm blooded. I'm cold blooded, I guess. I guess. And I just need to stay warm. So yeah, I go outside when it's really, really warm outside and I do not want to be wearing some bulky one piece just to cover up. Okay, can you see me? I've literally just got my camera sitting in side of this little slit in the back of my smoothie machine. So I'm gonna unplug it there just to be safe. I put five bananas this time instead of four into my lovely smoothie maker. <laughs> this is my business slash home slash office. And here we have smoothie number two. So I'm up to nine bananas and it's 11.08. And I will probably drink these pretty quickly actually. I tend to drink them faster, you know, when they're just smaller numbers of uh, bananas in there. Mm. Yeah, it's good stuff. Okay, so I'm going back to four bananas. And I'm getting really down to the bottom of the last bananas that I haven't frozen or anything. This is the whole case already. So I'm doing pretty good on those. I had to uh, freeze a bunch of them in that bucket you guys might have seen. It was an animal cracker container. And hopefully that will do okay. You want some more? And I'm sharing them with the kids. They just love eating these. Hey guys, so I'm just really loving this. Saving my extra smoothie till after nap time because then I'm just not in this huge rush to make something and eat. I can just think about dinner and plan dinner and prep for dinner, but I'm having something. So I'm not, you know, going to make, I'm a lot less likely to make bad choices. Yay. Okay. So you can't see this, but I am prank calling my Boyfriend's daughter while eating tostadas. <laughs> You're not going to put anything on that? Why don't you eat it over the plate? <laughs> or whatever. Get some lettuce on there. I am. I'm just close. Put it on the table. I don't think this one's going to go, though. This is just a tostada. Miss the epic burp. Tacos now, baby. <laughs> there are some beans in there somewhere.
somewhere. Salsa on top. Rocky, you're such a beggar. <laughs> I always lose count, but I think this is four now. Same thing. And I just put some new ones in there. If you're wondering, I'm doing them for um, broil, so about 500 degrees or whatever, just for a short time, and now they're off sitting there. Um, so they're kind of in between soft and crunchy. I'm about to run out of salad, which hasn't happened to me in weeks. Um, and I'm kind of going to freak out about it. And I'm about to run out of beans too, but yeah, kind of scared about the salad part. Freak out! No salad! Like I'm already craving salad because I and no, I'm not going to have any. Oh yeah. Okay, I managed to find, there was like three little wraps that we didn't eat yesterday. So I managed to find this and I'm eating one more. Don't judge me. And another one by Sudesta.